Hi everybody, today I'm so excited to show you how to make Mongolian beef fry noodles. Mongolian beef is actually a Chinese dish. Every time you walk into a Chinese restaurant, you cannot miss out those delicious fry noodles. Usually, fry noodles that come in egg noodles in Chinese restaurant, but everybody knows that bouncy noodles are much better in stir fry. So today I'm gonna use linguine pasta noodle in Mongolian beef fry noodles. Let's marinate the beef first. I'm cutting the beef in thin slices. But as you notice, I'm cutting the beef slightly diagonally. This excess fat, I'm gonna get rid of it. It's kind of fat I don't use. I'm just gonna throw it away. Here I have 250 grams of sirloin. I need one teaspoon of soy sauce. This is one tablespoon of medium cooking wine. One teaspoon of sugar, one teaspoon of sesame oil, and these two are my magic ingredients. I'm putting half tablespoon of baking soda. What it does, it breaks down the top part of the protein so it tenderizes the meat. And I'm putting one teaspoon of corn flour. What it does, uh, it makes those velvety mouth feel. I'm gonna marinate the beef and set aside corn flour and the baking soda are two magic ingredients used in Chinese cuisine. Here I have boiling water. This is 200 grams of pasta noodles. I'm gonna cook for eight minutes. A dash of olive oil. In the meantime, let's get the veggies ready. Here's what I need. I have about one third of carrot, uh, some bell peppers. I have red and yellow bell peppers, one medium sized onions, some bok choy and the green onions. You can cut your veggie whichever shape you want. These are the bok choy. This bok choy has a very fragrant flavor in Chinese fried noodles, but if you cannot get this bok choy, you can always substitute with asparagus. Green onions. In order to make a perfect pasta noodles, uh, it will be okay to have the timer when you are cooking the noodles. But you know what is the good way? Let me show you. What you do is, you take out one strain of noodles, let it cool, and you just throw it onto the wall. If this noodle sticks to your wall, that is the perfect time. <laughs> I think my noodles are done. A dash of olive oil. One tablespoon of garlic, one teaspoon of ginger. In goes my beef. Smells so good already. At this point, I'm putting one tablespoon of water and quickly cover the leaf. I'm gonna cover the lid for about a minute. What it does is that the corn flour and the water kind of forms a sweet gravy that will coat every strain of noodles later. Set aside. At this point, I'm putting the other ingredients, the bell pepper, the bok choy, and the green onion. I'm adding one tablespoon of water. Three tablespoon of oyster sauce. Two tablespoon of soy sauce. Two tablespoon of cooking wine. Two tablespoon of syrup. Two tablespoon of sesame oil and some black pepper. Give it a good stir. In goes my noodles and the beef. Give it a jiggle, a good stir. Your Mongolian beef fried noodles is ready. It's so delicious looking. With 200 grams of linguine pasta noodles, you can serve about two or three people. 
colorful vegetables. Look at this beautiful looking thick gravy. Mmm. Those corn flour and water just form a beautiful gravy. This is heap amount. You know, you can have a party with this. Sprinkle of sesame seed. Voila! Now that I made my Mongolian beef fry noodles, let me give it a try. Mmm! Wow! It's juicy, tasty, savory. It's so delicious. It's like walking on the Great Wall with a bowl of pasta noodles. A perfect collaboration of Italian and Chinese cuisine. I have to have another bite, but I have to say goodbye first. Try my recipe today, the Mongolian beer fried noodles. If you like my video, give me a big thumbs up and feel free to subscribe. I would like to have a lot of e paintings, you know. And leave a comment below. Thank you for all watching for my video, and I'll see you next time on my next video. Bye bye, people.